Hello everybody and welcome to another Cybernetics TV production. I'm your host, Insane Rabbi, and joining me is Nasa. How you doing, Nasa? I'm doing great. I'm hoping to watch these PvPs. Right. Game three, first two games. First one, pretty interesting. Second one, unbelievably awesome. Third one, I'm excited. Can't wait. So let's get it going. We'll talk about the uh, the game as it goes. So, for those of you watching the live cast, just doing the audio stream, we're at five seconds in the replay, and... Uh, Game three, Zelnaga Caverns. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. And we're off. So, we do have Adelscott again as the orange Protoss in the bottom left. And we do have Insolence in the upper right, uh, spawning as the green Protoss. So, oh, there's a proxy coming out here. Look uh -oh. at the uh, rally point on green. That is some uh -oh. proxy coming out here. He's proxying at the gold. And you know what? Uh, oh, not at the gold, at the natural. There it is. I'm like, why don't I see another proxy? That's that's in the scout path of orange. So we are going to see a proxy. Insolence, he's got to be rattled. He's down zero games to two after a beautiful timing attack in game two. I'm not going to give spoilers. Watch what happens. Unbelievable, though. Um, well, obviously, wait, I already said spoilers because Adel Scott's up to nothing. Um, just watch the game, see what happens, though, uh, for those of you that are watching this one first. So we do have the pylon finished and we are going to see an eight pylon, eight gateway going down for insolence. So this should be a one gate. Is it gonna be a one gate proxy? No, it'll be a two gate proxy. Um, yeah, I thought you needed at least nine or 10 probes to, to run two zealots and uh, look at the probe dance. That's pretty hot, not gonna lie. So we do have the scout coming out for Adelscott. His gateway is going down now. And second gateway going out. Oh, you gotta be careful. And insolence, oh no, it's gonna get scouted. Oh, man. Insolence. I feel for you, boss. Second gateway's got to be going down for Adelscott here shortly. And this is... He's just going to have to man up. He's got to outpower this kid with the, with the micro. He's going to have a slight advantage in zealot timing. I, I would hope. A slight. Barely at all. By the time it actually works... You know what? He's going to have zero advantage in zealot timing. He's down to pretty low amount of harvesters he's sitting at eight or just sitting at 14 so we'll see how this plays out probably gonna see a third gateway drop in as soon as possible and there's the chrono boost on the first zealot and you know what it's just looking ugly chrono boost coming out though um on these zealots for insolence first uh zealot coming in and he's just gonna have to auto the probes uh his his probe comes out you can't even fight the enemy zealots you just got to try and kill the harvester count while keeping your zealot alive and good job by Adelscott there, taking that probe out. It's actually a huge source of damage over time in these Zealot vs. Zealot micro battles. A lot of people don't realize that. And actually, Insolence chasing down Adelscott's first uh, Zealot. He retreats. Oh, and I'm being messaged. I gotta do the D&D. &D. Oh, I don't think that works in this game. Darn it. Oh, well. We do have Insolence with three Zealots coming out. And no corner boosting on the Zealots for Adelscott. This is looking pretty dangerous. Wow, Insolence coming in, tearing through the, the probe line. And now, surrounding, taking out a lot of... Uh, or taking out the Zealots of Insolence is Adelscott with the probes, but here we go. Adelscott now actually with the Zealot advantage. I take it back. Insolence with two Zealots. And the Harvester count kind of equal here. Nine to seven. And we do have two Zealots out for Adelscott. And oh, you got to watch that. Insolence taking a lot of damage on one of his Zealots, but it looks as though Adelscott at a slight disadvantage here. Now his third Zealot pops. Third Zealot pops for Insolence as well. This is crazy. I thought there was no way Insolence was going to win this, but he manned up, took out a lot of probes, and he's keeping even on the Zealot counts. And a fourth Zealot out now for Adelscott, and one of the Zealots going down for Insolence, so a 2-4 to four Zealot advantage in favor of Adelscott. You know, proxying when it gets scouted, very hard to stop. Third Zealot coming in for Insolence now, but a fifth one out for Adelscott. This is not looking good for Insolence. He's got to make something happen here. He's retreating to his gateways, fourth Zealot popping, but... You know, kind of too little, too late. Harvesters out to 11 for Adelscott. So he's got 11 to 7 in the Harvester count. And it looks pretty much like GG. Adelscott just doing some good micro here. Taking out a lot of Insolence of Zealots. 1 on 5 right now. Hero Zealot? I think not. This game looks pretty much like it's over. He's even chrono boosting probes now. So, unfortunate uh, Insolence's proxy. GG, well played. Coming out from Insolence. Adel Scott, ladies and gentlemen, is the victor. Three games to zero. Taking down the NVIDIA Gosu Cup. I actually don't know what the prize pool is. Uh, I think it's around $1,000, but I'll double check that. So, um, And it actually might be in euros, so it might be like 500 euros. Um, yeah.
Great play by Adel Scott. Good defense. I was a little scared there when he used his probes to surround those zealots. Um, I was thinking he'd lose a lot more probes than he did, but he ended up coming out on top. Nasa, any uh, any thoughts on this game? Well, if you notice from last game, um, Adel Scott actually did that probe scouting around the outside to check for the proxy. So I mean, maybe. Maybe he knew Influence liked to do proxies, maybe he knew there might have been some cheese coming up, or just, that's just how he scouts, but he was ready for that, that proxy gateway, even from last game. Maybe early zealots are too buff, which is why they're getting nerfed in next patch, right? I guess so, that's six seconds or whatever it is. Pretty important. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thanks for tuning in. This was the NVIDIA Gosu Cup Finals. Adel Scott versus Insolence. Adel Scott taking it down 3-0. Uh, pretty exciting series, though, even though it was a one-sided series. And as I said, thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned. We're going to have some more uh, some more games from ESL and the IEM tournament coming up to you uh, probably in the next couple days. So check back in at Cybernetics TV. And thanks for tuning in.